It's right there. Uh, what are you looking at? I don't there, see it. There's nothing up there. The future's bright with Beyond Limits, fellas. What? Come on, Titan, share us out. Come on! That was a lot of work. That was a lot of work. That was a lot of work. We just broadcasted on a secret squirrel page <laughs> we for, for <laughs> 10 minutes. <laughs> Hey, we were great for those of you who better believe it. It was really good. What's up, guys? Sorry we're a little late, but we're here. We are here. It appears we're late. We were on, everybody was on. Are we on on the Yeti? So what happens is I click a little button, and then I choose which page I want it to go to. Norman Kirk, out the gate with all your likes. Come on, Norman. And we have a secret page where we can test the feed if we're trying something new, and it's, it's, um... So it sends it to Facebook, but it's under a secret page, all right? And I was in here yesterday testing out a bunch of new stuff with YouTube, which works awesome, by the way. Yeah, man. I didn't want to try it today. What's up with that? Because I didn't want to mess things up. So we're going to try it after we're done today. So we can stream live to YouTube and live to Facebook at the same time now. We're going to do it one more test run today before we go um, live with it on Monday. We're excited about that. My yes. parents, my parents are gonna be thrilled about that. They we do can have, hop on there and interact with us. Yeah, so we'll be monitoring yeah. both YouTube and Facebook at the same time. But I forgot to take us off of the test page, so we're sitting here talking to y'all. We're, we're like, why is nobody loving us? And we're the only ones who can see it. <laughs> Good morning, so, Brandon Nicholson. Brandon Nicholson. Brandon. Scott Johnson. Scott Johnson. Susan Mosley. See, it's contagious. Wow. Contagious. Ha. Gee. That's good. I love it. Lord have mercy. I think there's sometimes I think that you, that you like um, a comment and then I follow you so quickly and like you it that like I unlike it. it. Yeah, it probably happens. So yeah, let's get some shares out. Let's let's, let's do share. I done done it. I done I just shared it, it to Wise and Gwine. I shared it, son. <laughs> I just said it to Wise and Gwine. All right. Let me take us off the here we go. Beyond Limits. That's us. Hey, Scott Bacon. What's up, man? It is our secret Sam and agent Cakes. page. Salmon Cakes is here morning, live. Kirk. Good morning, my awesome mother. If we told you the secret page, it wouldn't be a secret. But you, it's public, so you could find it if you search hard enough. It's just a, a word. Salmon Cakes. I don't... Un Timmy! Man, I'm just... Can I Tighten up! <gasps> We're 15 people away from crossing 1,500 followers. What? Share it out! Share it out. We Get need it out. 15 people. I'd love to get 1,500 before we leave here today. That would be awesome. What is going on in here? Dude, it's Friday. Man. Can we get 1,500 followers today? We need 15 more followers. We need 15 followers. I need cross my over 1,500. Hey. hey. So, let me tell you something. Tell them something good. I got, some, I got them socks on, man. Tell them something good. What I socks do have them socks on. They actually, they, they, you know. Good morning, Timmy. Okay. I got some socks on. Timmy Green. With them salmon cakes. Let's see. In, this is going to be my post for the day. In 15. I think this works right here. In 15. Well, good morning to you, Scott. We are. We are. Mm -hmm. I think that works. Okay. 15. Followers, I got a... Revive. Oh. Norman Kirk revive. says revive. Yes, away from... Revive. So we're good. 1,500. Listen here. I'm listening. It's Friday, man. I'm so excited. It is Friday. Oh, man, that's good stuff. Hey, man. Share, comma... Man, we need to get 40 people on the live stream at the same time today. That can happen. Scott, hey, hey. Live stream today. Hey, Cap, uh, uh, LT. Lord, I can't keep up with anybody nowadays. If you think, if you say that socks are good, then why are you trying to convince me to not wear socks? You were. You were trying to make me not wear socks last time. Socks, so sometimes you don't need to wear socks. Like, if you have loafers... Do you nice? Do you normally say that word loafers? No, but loafers are a type of shoe, in my opinion. Yeah, no, they are. I agree. They yes. used to be called penny loafers. Do you know why? Why? Because you could stick a penny. There was a, a slit in the top, and you you could stick a penny in there. I knew that. Did you really? I said I've heard about it before. They called penny loafers. They don't do it no more, do they? Nah. Why not? I mean, I guess you could. 
do it. Hey, so we are talking name brand or generic. Um, Corey says that he does generic cheese. I do, man. I can't do generic cheese. It just doesn't melt at the same consistency and time that regular cheese does. Now, if you were listening on the radio, I said generic cheese doesn't melt. That's and you exactly know what? what you said. If you put a cheeseburger on the grill. Wait, are you going to try and justify that point or are you going to Listen, just backtrack? listen. Just listen. If you put a cheeseburger on the grill and you put Kraft cheese, a piece of Kraft slash cheese on this burger, it will melt in approximately, while it's still on the grill, it will melt in approximately 15 seconds and okay. will be rolling over the burger. If you put a slice of your uh, grocery store sliced cheese on there. You can come back in 15 minutes. Not true. And it's not melted. Right. You know, you come back in like 20 seconds, it's going to be melted. So Velveeta is name brand. Velveeta is name brand. Yeah. To me. I like Velveeta. Best Vel- cheese, Sargentina. Sargentino. Yes. yes. Off the block, because it's our off the block cheese. It's really good. Yes. It's expensive, so we hardly ever get it. But I mean, I can't justify it. But sometimes you can but, find it on sale, like two packs for four bucks or something like that. Yeah, but yeah. What's it called? Sargentino? Sargentino like cheese. Sargento. 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 Yeah. What about Vel- what about Velveeta? That's what I just said. That's what we Hey, up it in me. He said hey, Welcome to the conversation. Timmy says up in up it in me and put uh Timmy said, uppity man put nickels in those loafers. So they're not penny loafers. So they'd be nickel loafers. loafers. Yeah, but, but yeah. Quarter dime. I think we, we talked about this a little bit yesterday, but I think uh, um, toilet paper is another thing you can't go generic on. <laughs> we did talk about that yesterday. And no, you, you, you can go gem- generic on toilet generic. paper. Generic. But you're going to pay for it. Yes, you will pay for it. You'll I don't know what y'all it. talking about. I use cha-ching all the time. That's a, that's a brand of... Is it really? Yeah, there is a where brand called it? cha-ching. Like Walmart? Where do you buy you it You can at? buy I know you buy it at Food Line. I don't know. Where do you buy it at? Food Line. <laughs> <laughs> so, Food Line. Um, <laughs> so, Food Line. And they say, mostly they sell like um, like paper products, like paper towels, toilet paper, yes. paper plates. Yes. Very cheap. Yeah. And, I mean, it gets the job done. You know what I'm saying? Look no. at Robbie. You do know. No. It, well, let's listen. Do you, no. do you? I am a name brand toy. So my parents use, they, they and I hear a lot of people talking about this, Sam's Club toilet paper. Everybody's loving the Members Mark toilet paper. It's just the, I, pass. Pass. See, I think you're being uppity. I'm not being uppity. Yes, you are. You don't need The question is name brand (laughs) versus generic. And I'm telling you. Some things that you just said like is. Yes, they are pasteurized, processed cheese product that melts promptly. I feel that you got too excited at the beginning of the sentence. And you could have possibly saved it to the Man, end. Man, you almost messed Come that on. all up, though. You, that's a lot of peas in there. I know. Yeah, that's, that's why like, I went That's on. like trying to say Pasteurized Master Sushi product. Chef and owner, Leo Chin. Promptly. Every time I hear that commercial uh, read, uh, is it the... If it, is it the freshly steamed buns? There's nothing well, wrong with generic. <laughs> Thank you, Scott Johnson. That, that makes me laugh now. Every time there's nothing wrong since with, he There posted. is nothing wrong with generic. What you saying? There's, there's nothing wrong with no, no. Nobody's I saying eat, that. I eat, gener- I, well, I eat generic. Hey, hey See, Scott Stanton says you don't have to buy it off. You go to your neighbor's house. <laughs> hey, can I borrow your roll of toilet cha-ching. paper for like Can I borrow your minutes? cha-ching? <laughs> <laughs> now he can walk over. To, hey, I need. See, your, I hey, I'm, listen, I'm not a fan. I need to borrow your bathroom toilet paper and a magazine for a whole hour. Elizabeth Mosley, we are not. My, oh I yeah, mean, you know how not buying. Some smartphone. Yeah, yeah. So you know how people go home and that's their time, bro. They just oh yeah, sit right there and just relax. What um? That my granddad man. That was like clockwork. Every time he got home from work. Uh, yeah. Oh, I, I, I bunch of nonsense. So my um, wife is now trying to get in on the Sam's Club toilet paper. Oh, I hear a lot of people I highly trust say things about Sam's toilet paper that are great. I don't know. Highly <clears throat> trust. Yeah, man. This is not... Okay, Liz. You know what? They need to know what she said. Yeah. Okay, so Liz says... Liz submits, because you can't say says. This is scholarly. 
I've heard great reviews from people I highly trust about Sam's Club toilet paper Cradle and paper them. towels. This is not like a scientific study. We're just asking, no. hey, what do you prefer? So We prefer name brand. For toilet paper name brand for cheese soda. There's no Dr. Thunder. Ever, <laughs> no Dr. Thunder? Ever in my house. No, uh, ever. Well, never, ever. What is a mountain? Uh, mountain, mountain Lightning. Mountain Lightning. Mountain Lightning, yeah. Lightning, yeah, okay. Mountain Lightning, Dr. Thunder. Mm-mm, so no. I remember the, and they're still out, right? I like, still do that, right? What? The, yeah. Those, yeah. those, those yeah, of course. Yeah. Um, back, back when my. I know, I know. First. Everybody loves their Sam's Club toilet paper. Oh, my God. I don't even shop at Sam's Club. Don't you? Garbage. That's because no. you don't have four kids. This is true. It's, 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 I it's, used to have a membership to Sam's Club. <laughs> so you're gonna say and I realized just to how much kids. I didn't need it. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Is it? I mean. It's a long ways out of the way to go to shopping it is, at Sam's Club. It is. And you might not need, like, a quarter year supply of ketchup. You yeah, might man. not. But well, once you're at my house, isn't it kind of annoying how, like, it's out. a little annoying how yeah, that's true. Sam's Club is a bulk store, yeah. but they do have things you can't get at other stores. But sometimes like those things, I'm trying to think. So they, they have, okay, so like they have cheap protein. Like the they do, cheaper, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? They do. Yeah. But do I really want to go all the way to Sam's Club to get it? You know? Yeah. So it's not like, like it's that find a buddy away. that has a Sam's Club membership. Give them twenty bucks and have them pick up the protein. That's cheating. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I, I don't even there, know you today. <laughs> yeah. I don't even know you today. No. Once you but said you could there's do something else. Off brand cheese. I don't. I, like they I don't have a good cheese. bakery. They do. <laughs> and what is it about yeah, Sam's really Club pizza? It's, yeah. it's good. Pizza the and their pretzels. Good. It's great. You know what yeah. I'm saying? So they got those little things. We were going to go to Sam's Club last night, and Elizabeth said, no, Sam's Club is not a place we just go to. Like, you have to have... you got to have a We're list. going to Sam's Club to get this. Yeah. Otherwise, you end up with, you know, enough ketchup to last you for... Till the kids Did you see college. the video of the kid who, for their birthday, asked for ketchup? And, like, they unwrapped... A ketchup container, like it's wrapped up and it is like priceless. They start crying no, and they are so happy that. that they got like a tub of ketchup. It's a no. legitimate video. That, that would be weird. I don't know. I I, mean, I, I, that's weird. Like, that's, I gotta show it to you. What's a tub, Who of, don't make a tub sense. of ketchup? My, my kids love this. Oh, yeah. Just, uh, yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Totally agree. Donnie Mac, we're talking name brand versus. Generic. Name mm-hmm. brand versus generic. Okay, and so these like, clowns say generic cheese is okay. Listen here. I can't. What I is generic cheese? All right, listen. Great, great, great value. Great value. Great value. Great value. Right. Yes. That cheese is fine. Yeah. Hey, listen. It's wrong. It's when like, it comes dude, to this, this dude says, this dude says cheese. it doesn't melt, <laughs> Joe. Hey. It doesn't I melt. I want to get, hey, listen. We know what we need to do. Listen. We want to remember this day. This day, for our, our hope, what our hope was, and then we need to go get a, the weather's starting to get nice, let's get us a cheap grill, and let's just have a day where we Have cook. a cheese melting contest, and watch Kraft Cheese melt in 15 seconds. Oh. I was going to say we have a, like a cook-off, or a cookout just outside. Just have a cookout. No, and let's we, have it inside. <laughs> no, that one. <laughs> right so here. We should seriously On the do live that. Stream. We should have a cookout. Cookout. I can't say cookout this morning. We do that, though, well, we and then we just put it to out. test. We could go to cookout. And, and we ask them our and we, cheese. And we could ask them, do you guys use generic cheese? And you know what they would say? No. Yes. I wonder. They would say yes. They probably do use some different kind of cheese. You don't spit though. out burgers for $5 a burger and use Sergentino. Or Scott Bacon said if you, if you buy generic cheese in <laughs> Sam's cheese. Club protein... Then you should go for the name brand toilet paper. Yes, you see, there's some things you got to get that's name brand, but some things just aren't as Cheese. expensive. Cheese is one of them. Well, I don't know. Like peanut butter. Lately, I've been buying generic peanut butter. Lately. I mean, yeah. it's good but I am more, more of a Peter Pan or night. Jif Man or Skippy. <laughs> I bought off. I bought all three. All right, so I could do pe- I, peanut butter doesn't. But my wife, if we buy anything other than Jif. Oh, yeah. That's because choosy moms choose Jeff. Yeah. yeah. And Cho- my mom, choosy. Yeah. My wife's the choosy Liz is wife. just a choosy mom. But uh, what else? Like, one but I, I mean, like, you got one minute. Cheese rumble! Like I said. Like I <laughs> okay, said. I guess I do. Then. Like I said, I mean, toilet paper, 
don't know. Uh, <laughs> all right. What else story. Do I you know what I think? I got the the Herald would demand. Yeah. The so pr- I got it. Kind of crook, baby. The primary, and I I think this is going to cover it all. Coming to generic or name brand. If it is the primary product, it has to be name brand. Like, like toilet paper is the primary product. Cheese is not the primary product. The burger is the primary, so I mean, cheese can be generic. I understand what you're saying here. You know, but I the hamburger. I don't, I don't agree with you, but I understand. Get a good burger. Yeah, you got to get a good burger. You got to get a good soda because what? that's the primary drink. You know, can't be doing no Doctor Thunder. Like, who cares about offering lettuce? Yeah, I don't... Or I'm not ketchup. Exact. Oh, uh, crap. I'm oh, wrong, then, because it's got to be craft. Hey, you yeah. have craft ketchup. It's got... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's got to be craft. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, generic cheese. Yes. Does melt. Yes, thank but you. But it just takes a lot longer to melt. I don't... I'm just saying no. I'm not no, Jared, Jared no. Bad Jared. Bad Jared. <laughs> go, go smack them. So the reason yeah. we're even talking about generic cheese uh, is because we want to know. Yes. Hop up on the live stream, your daily show. We want to know name brand or generic. Name brand or generic. What is your decision? And I believe 99% of the time, if it is the primary if it's the primary ingredient. Yeah, I like this thought process. If it's the primary with. ingredient, then it's got to be name brand. So for Corey and I, mm-hmm. like cheese does not need to be name yeah, brand. Maybe. Like, because the primary thing is the burger. Right. Toilet paper, name brand, because that is most certainly the primary product at that point in time. Right. You know, soda, name brand. Uh, you know, nothing against Dr. Thunder, but I mean. Mountain Lightning. You know. Let's yeah. do it. Yeah, I, yeah, I, I could, I agree. I mean, I only have like a, a small fraction of generic items in my cupboard at the apartment. But I'll tell you that uh, peanut butter is one of them. Yeah. Um, paper yeah. products are normally one of them. Yeah, I can do generic paper products. Paper towels. Yeah. Yeah. Toilet well, paper. I, what you talking? What, 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 <laughs> what, 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 what other see. paper products are there? Because I don't want to be, I don't want to be cleaning up a mess with fifty-seven sheets of. Off brand paper towels when I could use They're all one absorbent. sheet of whatever. I don't brown, think, but see, that it doesn't really go down like that. It doesn't. It You're does. going to grab four sheets regardless oh, of no. this. Field. Yeah, really. Oh, it's no. just that excitement. You're like, oh, I need, I need to clean this up quick. And then you know, you've got <laughs> five sheets of bounty. When you only need one, you're going to do the same thing with that Nobody. cha-ching brand. <laughs> cha-ching is a real thing. I don't know why cha-ching people don't know. Is a thing. Cha-ching is a thing. It, Corey has saved $1.57 over the past seven years. Dude, no. I guarantee you it's it's more than that. Yeah. You go buy a pack of cha-ching paper towels, man, it's like 98 cents. Um, you try to buy a bounty or something like that, it's like four fifty, man. He, yeah, probably. That's true. I'm telling you, man. I know what I'm talking about. You, the world's... Disagree. Kindest crook. Dude, how about this? So, guys, check this out. This is an amazing story. Um, A Chinese man is being hailed as the world's kindest crook after recently released security footage shows him taking on the woman he was robbing. That's right. He was robbing this woman. This story cracks me up. And he actually gave her her money back. So, the woman who was identified by her surname, Lee, was withdrawing money from an ATM at an ICBC bank in, get ready, Haiyuan, China, last month. When she was accosted by a man wielding <laughs> a knife. So terrified, she looks back, sees the man has the knife. Lee quickly gave him 2,500 yuan, which is $371 American, uh, that she had just withdrawn from the machine. But the man was unsatisfied with that amount of money. And so he asked her to show him her account balance. Well, he saw that her account balance was at zero. Yep. And he said, oh. He smiles, laughs, laughs, and just gives her the money back. Yeah. I'm sorry, I'm not going to rob you. You don't have a lot of money. And uh, then he back. just walks away, and she you can see her on the footage look at, like, what in the world did this just happen? Yeah. And then later he's detained by police and, and arrested. But he's being hailed as the world's kindest crook. Yeah. So I don't know. I'm on the fence. Well, obviously, you should never rob anybody. Correct. You should. He's definitely in the wrong. Yeah. Um, but he gave the money he back. I, I back. guess he he's said- like a Chinese Robin Hood. He only wants to, he <laughs> yeah. I'm serious. He I mean, it's just the rob from Robin the rich. I, I read this story Ooh. going into today's your show, bro. and I was impressed with it. But I am more impressed with your ability to say all the words you just said. <laughs> Dude. As you were saying it, like, you said them perfectly. And I didn't even know, like, that is crazy. 
Yeah, I mean, hey, that, that is what it is. We do what we do. And I also buy generic cheese, Jared. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but guys, we are doing the fastest two hours in radio, having a great time. But now, When We Pray by Torn Wells. Yes. All right, Elizabeth brings up a great point. Yeti? Yeah. Elizabeth Yeti. brings up a great cool. point. We always do generic medicine. Cool. How is he a Chinese Robin Hood? Because he, he, maybe. He, no, he took okay, from okay, the Okay, okay, okay. listen. Robin Hood took from the rich and gave to the poor. Is that yes, a fresh but, but he took from the poor and gave to the poor. But therefore, <laughs> therefore, I feel like there's times where I'm so like, dude, I'm too I'm broke. Like, Joe, money, robbed. help me out with this, dude. So therefore, let me ask you this: Would Robin Hood have robbed the poor? Would he have robbed the poor? No, he would have only robbed the rich so he could give to the poor. I see. What I'm see? doing? I see. I see what you baby. did. Money. That what that guy was doing? No, well, he Do robbed the Do you listen to our content, or you just oh, listen man. to the sound? It's hard to sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> all I heard was a Chinese man hey. robbed the lady and then gave Did you hear him say all the words? Like, that surprised me. I, I thought you were going to... All right, so... Not only, like, but you said the name the of name, the... name, the money, the currency. Uh, yeah. And, and where it happened. That's probably not how you pronounce that. All right, we don't... really good. Yeah. In my mind, I had skipped over it. Yeah, so he gave back. So he took the I had to prep the audience. You know why I like this story? Don't you see? Because I've been in college before and been like... You know, like... I was like, hey, dude, can you give me some money? I'm like... I ain't got no money, man. <laughs> hey, Norman about? Kirk wants to know if you guys want breakfast. Paul, DM me on Facebook and let me know what you want from Mick D's. Here is a surprising fact about me. I don't, I rarely eat breakfast. Do you not? I'm going to tell you whoa, something. Whoa, whoa. Recently, I've only been having like, because we get up nice and early for this. We do. And I don't, it's too, if I'm going to eat breakfast and it's going to be a big breakfast, I prefer it to be around eight or nine, not six, five, six or seven. You know what I'm saying? I can't eat this early um, yeah. for some reason. So I just have, um, I can eat. May, I may or may not be getting sup dogs for lunch today. So you mm. know, I did, but I've done that. I've done that. The last, I've done that the last three mornings, man. I just had a, a thing of Greek yogurt. Yeah, man. <laughs> no, no, no. Just a thing of Greek yogurt and a banana. But I'm especially proud of that this morning because I'm probably gonna have something. You know what eat. I'm proud of this morning? I'm getting my fresh haircut, and I, I told um, the shave on fifth, Mike. I told him I was gonna do this. Yeah. I'm getting a fresh haircut today. Today is our first day in Kaufman's. Oh, yeah. Are you going expanded. to that one? Nah, I'm going to the old one just because Oh, it's I their got an first day. They're opening up yep, at, Kaufman's. at Kaufman's. I want to see what that's like. That at should... Kaufman's. It's over off Red Banks. Uh, Did you say what, Kaufman's? Where is Kaufman's? Oh, it is off Red Banks. It's off Red Banks. It's in that little strip mall like where the Bailey's is and yeah. uh, the Nino's and all that, that right there. Um, but I'm excited about that because hopefully it'll open up their availability a little more. And that's not a jab at them. They just do such good, such a good job that they stay super busy, do a lot of business. What's the address of uh, this place? Do you know? I haven't got the slightest clue. Do you know? Oh, West knows. Yeah. I'll go ask him real quick. I'll be right back, guys. Josh. Don't leave. All right. So look who it is, guys. Oh. New guy, Josh. Nope. <laughs> I just took a seat. I fell. Right? Uh, <laughs> Alright, get it out of your system. You've been going for like you've been going for like seven months, dude, with your sickness. Seven what? months. What did you have like Yo. tuberculosis or something? Yo. Hipster cut. Uh, I, I don't know what I had. They they said it was the allergies for her. I mean they said it was alright, so first I had the ear infection. Remember? Then they said oh yeah. Hey, whoa, so, whoa, whoa. Got the ear infection. Then they say it's the allergies. No and now it's it? asthma. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. We're not on the radio. I don't know what that means. It means we're not on the radio. I know we're not on the radio. I mean, not right now, but we're not on the radio at all. Like, we haven't, like, oh. our segments haven't been on the radio. Here, let me come to you out there. Oh, wow. Well, <laughs> we're on the live stream, though. Hey, Paul, when can I call you for the time? When can I call you, you, for the time? You can call me. It's just and an excuse I don't know why. so I can call We're and not... bug you. Anytime, Jared. Anytime you want to call me, you can call me. Thanks, buddy. I appreciate that. You as well. You as well, you my friend. You said, Jared. 
You were talking to me? Oh, geez. Hi, Josh. Um, so, yeah. Is a way bottom is Well, that's... <laughs> what do you do? What do you do? Well, so we could just redo no, uh, no segment idea. two. And we had some great on-air segments too. I feel. Oh, 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 they weren't on-air segments. Serious. They were off-air segments. Don't, segments. don't tell Corey. It will ruin it his life. It will ruin his life. Hey. I was taking your seat. You've, you've been uh, promoted to the seat down here. <laughs> No, he is not demoted. I said promoted. Get him in. Get him in the corner. Nobody puts baby in the corner. No generic cheese, toilet paper, laundry detergent. Hey, for me, it don't matter. I mean, Jessica, as long as, I'm, I mean, as, long as Jess, cheese ain't passed I'm reading from the readers, not from the I'm not gonna tell you again. It don't matter what. There's nothing wrong with it. I'm, I'm reading from no, the reader. There. I'm, I'm a Corey. I'm a Corey. How about generic turkey bacon? <laughs> <laughs> Chris Truitt. So, Chris, I know you weren't on here the other day, but um, but I used your what you put up on Facebook um, on Monday as part of our devotion time. So. Excuse me. Hey, I'm gonna tell you everything, and Jared is Jared may not be aware of this, but everything Jessica Lemon posts has to be read in country music ever since. Uh, it's probably been two months now. She did something in a country song. I was there. It was we was were, it us two? Yeah, it was us two. So Jessica Lemon, everything is country. Turkey bacon is not bacon. This right. is New generic cheese. Hey, Scott Bacon, oh Stanton, bacon says turkey bacon is not bacon. I concur. Says the man who has bacon in his Facebook name. I want to know, Scott Stanton, why do they? Why is your middle? Why is your name bacon in your Facebook name? Well, he loves bacon. I'm assuming it's got something to do with him liking uh, bacon. Corey argued with Aaron. He will not eat generic cheese. It yes. says it doesn't melt. Yes. No, not yes. you too. Generic cheese does not melt right. Aaron Lemon, that is complete ludicrous. You know generic cheese melts. We're going to have a conversation about this tonight when I see you at Pitt CC. I saw him no, last generic night. Generic cheese does not melt right. That is a bunch of baloney. No, it's cheese, it's a bunch but of, it's still false. That's a that's a bunch of generic hey, bologna. I don't like generic uh, bologna. Generic bologna. Yeah, you can't do... No, yes. I don't like I, generic yeah. bologna. No generic... Because it's the primary yeah. focus of what you're eating. You yeah. want a bologna sandwich? It's got to be good. Yeah. What about bread? Is there a search what? thing as generic bread? Yes, no. there is. Yes, there is. You can get Harris Teeter bread. Uh, I've yeah. never had Harris Teeter bread. But I have heard that Lidl bread is terrible. See? So... Yeah. We always get we only there's only one kind of bread that's a that can be used at my house. Have you tasted? Oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. Amen. Come to First Free Will Baptist of Washington. That's right. We get to hear our sponsors all day long. Um, <laughs> all day long. <laughs> Southern Creamery is that is that Southern simply Creamer? Southern Creamery Sim milk? Is that the name of it? What's the Amen. natural creamery? No the, simply, natural? simply Natural. Simply Natural. Oh, yeah. At a, at a, uh, so you could buy their milk now yes, in stores. Yes, fantastic. But that's not... So I am lactose intolerant. If I drink milk... How then we... you get all grumbly, tumbly? Yes, it is not fun. Yeah. But I can... Uh -huh. it, I can eat... And same thing with ice cream, all that stuff. So... But I'm saying, though, like... You do... I can drink... I can do simply the creamery. I can do the creamery. But that's... Ice cream. Is it, it nature it. zone? But why does that... Oh, why are we even talking mind. about yeah. simply natural creamery? Because being... So, there, so, so you have generic, then you have name brand, and then you have, like, pristine milk. Which is simply natural creamery. Is pristine. Yeah, like you got Mayola, which has been around forever. Yeah, yeah. Mayola. Yeah, got, I'm not a Mayola fan. If, if it's between Mayola See, or Harris Teeter, ooh, I could do any milk. That's I, that's that's something I do buy generic. Cause, well, no, not anymore. I'll now, buy food line milk. Now I get, uh, now yeah. I, yeah, yeah, I, I used to, I used to get, when I would get the gallon jugs. Thank you, Dad. It would be, um, my dad's coming it to It would mind. be food line. My dad agrees. Generic cheese is fake cheese. Garbage. Fake cheese. Well. Any cheese is good as long as it's not past the expiration date. Listen I mean, here. Come on. No, yeah, as but now, you, you know what milk I get? I'm fancy. I get fair life. Oh, fancy, fancy, bro. You know, you know why? I don't, even, I don't know you don't what even, fair life is. That's why you have to have cha-ching toilet paper. I don't want to say it. <laughs> yeah. Because you, you spend all your money on fair life. It's, how, what? Huh? I, get, it's I, like, I get a, a it's half gallon. It's $18 gallon. for a half gallon. No, it's not. Right. It's, I get a half gallon. <laughs> fair life. It is good. It's, it's really, good. really good. Now, the chocolate milk. Good? I've chocolate. had chocolate milk. Oh, man. That's what my kids. They, my kids want the creamery chocolate milk or the Fairlife chocolate yeah. milk. Oh. Is it yeah. Did, is the radio figured out? Yeah. 
Ah, uh, we'll be back on the radio next segment. Sorry, were, guys. Were we on the first segment? Yeah, we were on them all of them. It was just the commercials started playing in Chaco. Ah, so we were on in Greenville, but not in Chaco. Chad Cunningham, At what all. is up, my friend? Everything we were on by segment. Good. So we're talking generic or name brand. Are there certain things you can do generic? Thank you, Robbie Strayer. Or do yeah. you have to have... See, if anybody... Mouse is on this screen over here. Oh. And it fired the commercials over there. So they were listening to commercials. Even though we it were got on, them fired up. they were hearing commercials. Yeah, I'm fired up. Hey, so... Hot dogs? I can't do. Because people do up store here are brand saying I can't hear you on the radio. If Robbie Strayer right says now. generic cheese melts from last well. segment. Generic cheese. If anybody's gonna know, it's no. Robbie Strayer. No. Gen- he said. I'm just telling you right is now. Is somebody in the car so now is, listening, or is? How much time do we have? Wes is listening. How's it sound? How much time do we have? We sound great. However, know? they weren't hearing us on the radio. At all? That's okay. Yeah. Name brand but or it's generic. I debated, and I probably shouldn't have said it out loud. Yeah, I we, said, let's not tell Corey. Corey he will did lose. say that. Corey will. F- he did Corey say that. Corey will. I did, but I did it out loud. <laughs> they didn't hear it all. Corey's day is shot He said now. didn't hear you in Blackjack Greenville either. They didn't? No. Nope. How? How did that happen? It was, a good, it was a good, like, all your was, very you good did words. Great. You, you did great. You did good, really Corey. big words. You no, did, I'm saying, I mean, like, it's all good. I mean, I just don't say it was like, was it dead air? I don't know. It was commercials. <clears throat> Hey, how was John? Listen, oh, I got my service story coming up. I don't understand. I love this story. We got like thirty seconds. Yeah, all right. Who's on third? Who's having a good show? This is what it is. Paul's opening. Hey, we 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 flew. Yeah, we got a huge audience. We we flew back on the air. Oh, am I starting? Just start, baby. Fluidity. Let's do it. I felt I started last time. Five. Uh, I did. Yeah, so the live stream is hot. This morning, it is on fire. We are talking generic or name brand, generic or name brand, and we have agreed that if the primary source of what you are intaking or using has to be name brand, it it has to be name brand, but if it's like the buns, then eh, it could be generic. Yeah, you can do great value buns. Isn't it amazing just how something so simple like this, this hook in itself is such a popular topic. Like, yeah. it's, I mean, it gets us debating so much. Yeah. You know what I no mean? No generic cheese. You're, no, no, Jared. No, bad Jared. Bad Jared. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, generic cheese melts just as good so as we're Sargento, probably 50, Velveeta. 50 here on the hey, Facebook live stream. What about Cracker Barrel? Wait, Ooh, whoa. Cracker, cracker Barrel, barrel, barrel cheese? cheese with a- crackers? Yes. Absolutely. Yes. Yes. Absolutely. Come that on, is somebody. totally name brand. Oh, now. man. Totally name brand. Y'all, listen to this story. So, there was a, there's a lady... Who has a service dog, right? Which a lot of people have service dogs to help them, you know, if, if they're blind or if they're having seizures or um, if they're deaf. You know, a lot of people have service dogs yep. and they do such awesome work. Yeah. And I hear about them helping them cross the street, alerting people when they're about to have an episode. Yeah. But this particular service dog, man, this girl has seizures so bad that sometimes they last up to two hours my goodness and so she can't it, it totally crippled her day-to-day life so th- she got a service dog when he was one years old and this dog okay it helps her across the street yep it helps her get up in the morning and get dressed it gets her clothes it gets her towels it gets all that stuff for her. but man this dog also pays for her for her stuff when she goes to the store she gets her dog the the credit card and yeah. it goes up to the register and pays for her food She'll say, get the receipt, and it'll pull the receipt Because she's off. in a wheelchair? She's in a wheelchair. She okay. can't get it. That's amazing. So it does that. It, I mean, it, it it just it helps her out, and it gets what kind food of dog for is her. It? It, it's a lab. Wow. That's pretty yeah. cool, man. It that gets is food cool. for her. It gets that. everything that she needs. And I so love that. she has said that this because of this dog, yeah. she used to have somebody with her 24 hours a day. Yeah. Um, but because of the dog, he's alerted people several times when, it was, um, when she was about to have a seizure. Yeah. So she, he's prevented... The, the hardness that goes with that. Uh-huh. She's been she's gotten married and she's working again full time at her in her career. That's so, amazing, man. Man, God bless God yes, bless man. service dogs. It's that amazing cool. what God can do through so many different facets, man. A, a dog. You know what I mean? Yeah. A lot of people but it's amazing what training can be done to those animals That's right. and I mean he alerts people when she's about to have, you know, a seizure. Yeah. That's so amazing. He said the other day she was in she said the other day she was in the 
bathroom getting ready and he yeah. comes in and pushes the door open yeah. and starts barking and runs she said i had no idea what was going on ran and got her caregivers mm -hmm. they got in there right as they got in there she fell over and passed out with a seizure and she said i had no idea it was coming on that's so awesome yeah that's a, such a good story to hear. Animals have in, those crazy. Remember that random fact from months ago we did where snakes can predict earthquakes yeah. up to oh, like yeah. two weeks in advance. Oh, yeah. Well, that's why, man, like when I go home and I like see my parents have a Chesapeake Bay Retriever. Yeah. And when that dog's <laughs> ears move funny or something, I'm looking around like, hey, man, what's about to happen? Yeah. You know, <laughs> I mean, because they notice things way sooner. Yeah, we do. They, they smell do, things man. better. They're I mean, so they just smart. do. They have just a better reaction time. I'm going I'm to tell you, uh, Doing canine cop with Green Boy, mm -hmm. you, you learn a lot of things. And when the dogs go to sleep, yeah, they're all their ears are always stuck up right. And even when they're sleeping, because their ears are independent of each other, yeah, like one ear will turn if they hear noise. Dead asleep, wow, but they're still awesome. completely listening for quote unquote danger. That's so that's cool, awesome. you know but it's I, also funny. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I bet I know what she didn't do. She didn't give him a piece of generic cheese for a treat oh, when Jared. he saved her. Hey, listen, we're coming back fastest two hours in radio. Second hour coming up next. Second hour coming up next. Fluid. Fluid the whole way. Fluid the whole way, young man. I love that story, man. Like, this dog pays for stuff when she goes <laughs> out. Like, she hey, man. Him, like, Scott, those... Scott's coming to the front door, man. Robbie... Come on, Scott. But he won't. I want to feel comfortable. Robbie Strayer said, All my dog is good for is laying around and drinking out of the toilet. Yeah. <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa. What? Did you just get leaked on? Yeah. That must be a generic filter. It's not a filter. It's a, uh, <laughs> what, are you playing games, Josh? You look like you got sleep last night. It's like you, you look fresh. Yeah, Norman? I did. It might be the haircut. He was saying Scott is here. Oh. I said Norman. I don't know which Scott. Maybe Scott Johnson? Maybe Scott Bacon? Maybe. Radio sounded good here. They said. All right, good. Yeah, man. I don't. I don't know what it was. Um, I put it out and I told them to ask. Um, if if they heard us on the radio, but they said they didn't hear us the first Woo! segment. Come on in. The second segment. Sorry, the second segment. They were said they kept asking, "Are y'all on the radio?" Question mark because we don't hear you. Yeah. Oh, we're definitely on that one. Right? Uh, yeah. Yes. Liz said she heard us on that one. But they were saying. Um, it's probably because I. This they said they didn't hear you. In, accident, had no clue. Yeah. They didn't hear you. Hey, in Scott. Black hey, y'all want to see a cop? Scott. Scott. Yeah. Okay, yeah. I'm right here. I'm a cop. <laughs> <laughs> you good, man? Hey, you're protecting the server, man. Hey, Scott. Hey, tonight, 6, 530. All right. 530. So, hey, so, see, yeah, Scott. They said that we weren't on in Blackjack Green Bull. That we weren't on in Simpson. What like, what there? were they hearing, though? In oh, so, they, they said that. They were hearing... Um, the people that were on before we came, we come on every day. Kevin and Taylor. Kevin and Taylor. Yeah, yeah. Like, why would it switch back to Kevin and Taylor? That means we were weren't all off the network, right? Well, we are when we're on this thing, but I guess if the mouse was ever here, it tagged me as if I it switched was back. Off hey, you know what, man? Growing pains, baby. Growing pains. Hey, I'm gonna tell you. So this is a lot we of people. We gonna learn. So what happens is, it's my. The graphics segment, we're on yeah what happens is so the radio 98.3 hey, thanks the, Irene happy Friday the radio 98.3 the bridge think of it as highway 95 constantly going it's called Salem Network okay so it's streaming it's coming from Tennessee so what y'all hear during the day is coming out of Nashville Tennessee Atlanta Georgia Kevin and Taylor's in Atlanta, yes. Georgia, and what they do, they're syndicated, so they send their um, stuff into Nashville, yes. and then we get it out of Nashville. Right. Nashville is our hub, and they, they it's like a spider web, sends everything out. If we want to do our own independent show, which is what we do here locally, we have to get off of that. So you think of this main hub, 95, awesome. being the main on. network, all right? Well, when we want to do our show, we have to get off of the main hub, so it's like 264. All right, but we can only do it at certain times, and it has to be done during uh, a top of the hour segment. So at nine o'clock, we can retract, get off of them, and run our own show. Yes. Um, but you can't get back on at, but only at certain times. So how about generic donuts? There are no such thing as generic, generic donuts. donuts. Thank you, Corey. You want one, brother? Thank you, Corey. I'm no. gonna get one. No, I'm good. I'm gonna get one. Actually, man, yeah, I, I well, what I've been doing, man. 
is I've been like kind of been loosey goosey on the weekends, but nothing major. Like if I don't have a lot of that, I don't have a lot of simple sugars. But I heard, man, that. So I heard that, uh, and somebody on the live stream helped me out that they remember ever, this ever being said. I heard that Krispy Kreme donuts, the original glaze, which that is, they're actually not terrible for you compared to the other stuff you can get. In fact, I want to see how many calories. I want to say it's something really bizarre, like only like 90 calories. But that can't be right, but I'm going to see. How many calories are in an original glazed how many calories are in an original glazed donut from Krispy Kreme Krispy Kreme was number one hit yeah. 100, 190 in one donut in one donut but man that's, really not, that that's not that bad 190 calories yeah 100 it's Did not you get terrible 109? People you get, get like the, the hundred calorie pack. Yeah. And they're like, ooh, it's only hundred calories. One hundred and ninety calories. It's like two packs. How many calories in a crispy? Let me see if there's a breakdown. Okay, here we go. This is a complete bake yeah. breakdown. All right. Is that what you're looking? Yeah. So here we go. Thank you. One hundred and ninety calories. Uh, Michael. Paul Eleven Armstrong grams of fat. Donut. <laughs> sugars. That's what I'm worried about the most. This is what's really impressive. Only ten grams of sugar. There's usually things of sugar. Ten grams, of sugar? 10 grams of sugar. Ten grams of sugar. That's it. That's not tell them. That's not a lot. That's not a lot at all. I mean, it's not like you know. Still, this is not the you best. You know what that means? That means I'm eating another one, baby. Still, this is not the best thing in the world for you to eat. However, it ain't the worst thing. Nonetheless, Scott Johnson, we love you, and we're gonna get you back. We're gonna do something special, with Scott Johnson, my man. Yes. And he's gonna be proud of me because I'm actually going to eat this thing. Yeah, baby. How do you feel about your decision-making skills? Oh, no, it's a big one. Oh, no, it's a big one. Oh, no, it's a big one. That was good. That's good, man. And I got a fresh cup of coffee. Come hey, on, come man. On. Hey, Josh. Come on, somebody. Yeah. Mm. Thank you. Man. Can I tell you something? Uh, you got sugar hanging off your mouth. I don't know, <laughs> coffee. I'm on a winning streak. But it's only... It's how you define winning streak. But it's your, only, your heart would disagree with you right but now. But it's, it's, only, uh, it's only 10 grams of sugar. 200 Thanks, calories guys. of carbs, but only 10 grams of sugar. How many carbs were in there? I don't remember. 100%. <laughs> yeah, that's probably right. <laughs> Dude, Krispy Kreme, don't All right, no generic shampoo, conditioner, body wash, deodorant, etc. Hey, I'm in on that program. Do you think... Yeah. Corey, how do, long? You use, huh? do you use Snappy Wappy... Um, deodorant? Snappy Pappy deodorant? No. Old Spice. So you're name brand deodorant? Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. What is not name brand deodorant? Did, was that a real thing? Snappy no, Wappy? You're um, such a trickster. But <laughs> they have great value deodorant. Hey, how fast, how easy... Why do you, do you say the things you say sometimes? <laughs> <laughs> How easy do you think I can eat one of those whole don't those donuts whole? I think you could eat one. You just let's do it. Hold on. I'll, wait. Hold on. I'll, I'll tell you what. Me and Jared are gonna both do it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Give us a donut. Donut us up. Come on. What are you What are you about to do? Yeah. We're gonna eat both. No, no chewing. The whole donut is going in here. Wait. Oh, I can't do hold, this. No, no. Hold on. This. The, Y'all, okay, hold on. There's so much going on in my Paul's mind right now. Out right Dude, on. you got to do it. Guys, do, live stream, do you want to see this? We're going to. Somebody brought us donuts, man. I can't man. do it. Who? Y'all need to vote I who's going to win. I can't. My belly's a lot bigger, but my I can't. I can't get the whole donut in there. So here, yes, you can. Here's what we're going to do. Come on, man. In one minute, y'all have one minute, one single minute. Type in here who is going to eat their oh donut faster. Faster. Who's gonna eat this thing faster? Who's gonna eat one donut faster? All right, me, me one or minute. Jared? Completely, completely swallowed. Yes, okay. completely swallowed. I'm, I'm just chew it up, and I mean, I'm not trying to be disgusting, but when you look, when the, ah, if it's not in there, you're good. Joe, are you ready for this? All right, hey, do you want to? Do you eat donuts? You do. I've seen yes. what you eat. Of course, you eat donuts. He'll beat us all. Can you grab a donut? Josh is in it too. Josh. Josh is in this. Oh man, it's three of us. This dude's gonna own y'all. I know. I don't you gotta believe be on the camera. You're gonna get. He's gonna get that glaze everywhere, bro. All right. You want me to get down here? No, no. Get oh back, dear, Elizabeth Moses. Oh dear. <laughs> yeah, it's your medical bill. Get back Liz, here. So. 
Notice I'm not eating them. Corey oh. only needs 15 seconds. Boy, you crazy. Hey, you talking about some 15 seconds, Pipkin. Do we have time for this? Yeah. Do yes. Wanna, how much time do we We're have? We're not doing it on air. How much time do we have? We like six or seven minutes. Perfect. Oh, yeah. All right. All right. We don't even need that. Guys, hey, about another 30 seconds. Oh, Corey. I'm Jerry, tired of this. I'm tired Corey. of waiting. We're, gonna, we're just uh, waiting on people wait. to say who's going to win. See, Josh is going to win. I, Irene is going for Jared. Josh isn't winning. Robbie's pulling for Jared. Who can dial a Krispy Kreme donut the fastest? Elizabeth is getting her copay ready. <laughs> <laughs> Between me, Matt, Jared, and uh, Josh. Matt says Corey. Thomas says Corey. All right. Ready? On your mark. Get set. Shovel donuts. <laughs> or his laptop is ruined. <laughs> Come on, Corey. He's done. Corey, Corey was the Dude, I know what's up, baby. <laughs> yes. Now, hey. Are you done? All that. All that, okay? all that glaze yeah. landed right perfectly in this uh, napkin. <laughs> it did. It did, bro. Is everybody okay? Yeah, I bro, just, we're good. I, I'm a, I now, just swallowed. Now the trick is, Scott got that while the hot now sign was on. Yes. So if them things weren't hot, but they weren't like stifling hot, so it wasn't like I burned my just mouth. We put the whole thing in our mouth. Yeah. And then it and then it was dry. Though. Yeah. Now you that, had to like work up a little bit. Of, if that thing was not like warm. That thing wouldn't, it wouldn't went down like that, North Carolina. It wouldn't went down like that. My man, he beat me by like three seconds. <laughs> Straight in hell does donuts. Yes, we did. I made the sugar. <laughs> That's awesome. That was fun. That was fun. I don't feel good about what we just did. Like, yes, we did. Yeah, you should feel totally good about you. You should feel good about that. Was that was totally no, your idea. Y'all came up with it. No, I didn't. And then I just promoted it because I saw okay. the, the no, content. Idea. But you see, I got to say, I knew... That that was gonna happen because, uh, just because of how like, what's the word I want to use? The good the good scientific word, the pliability of the donut due to the temperature of its inner core. You just, uh, ate, <laughs> you just ate two donuts. I know, bro. You I, ate. Well, I'm going to do two hundred and eighty. I'm gonna do bike patrol later. Three eighty. Three hundred and eighty calories. Paul, listen to this. All right. So what the other day, I went with my mom. Why aren't you surprised that I just so ate three hundred eighty calories? Creams. We purchased on a fresh hot nails. Um, it was like two, three days ago. Um, and I ate six. That's so funny, man. All at one time. That's what. One that's day we'll a, do that's that. That's a good. One day we we'll get two dozen, and we'll see who can eat a dozen. Oh my God. So, so 190 got, times. You know what? This, this we probably just just stumbled upon something really cool. <laughs> eating, Forget the morning show. Eating, We're going to competitive eating. Competitive eating <laughs> challenges with 98.3 the bread will be on limits. I'm telling you. No. Huh? <laughs> Paul's, we're gonna have a pie eating contest and Paul's gonna get that beer ruined. I'm telling you. <laughs> well, Paul is scared right now. Yes, Y'all cannot is. see his face. He yes, is literally he is. scared that we no. might actually. We promote yeah. health. We have always promoted health and fitness. And I now, y'all, we have gone to shoveling <coughs> donuts. Let me tell you something. Dude, I, I have never promoted fitness. Yeah, I feel bro. like we should. Like, we have runners. No, we don't promote fitness. I, I mean, I, I like fitness, and I'm about to promote fitness. Matt, but. Matt Mike, Mike Hatfield <coughs> says, never mess with a cop's donut Eating skills. You better tell him again, Matt Hatfield. <laughs> Mike. Mike, Matt, I'm, I, I, I think I'm going into a sugar coma. <laughs> <laughs> He's never. I've never seen him eat one donut, let alone. Dude, I eat some food now. Two. You just don't be seeing. But I haven't had a Krispy Kreme donut in a while. But I've had other things. What did I eat last weekend that I was kind of, I felt really, I felt like, oh, I shouldn't have done that. But it was, is what it is. I really have, like, on the weekends, we really we're trying to go to that place this weekend if we can find the time that uh that place I was telling you about in Raleigh the pizza place, Benny Capital's a huge slices of pizza. What is oh it called? yeah, ben, what is it? It's called I think it's either Benny Capital's or Benny Capitale's. I don't know. You're have to go on Sunday. Probably will because your Monday. Your I know you can go Saturday. Night. I could maybe Saturday evening because mm -hmm. uh we're office. actually gonna go. Man, my parents are gonna go to um Harbor Church Sunday. Hey yeah. Hey. So Deanna's gonna stick around for that. 
Um, so we won't have to, you know, she won't have to go all the way back to her for county. So yeah. she has to bake. Her mom's going to handle that for her. So, yes, it'll be good. You're going to be at Harbor Church too then? Yes, Sunday I will. Sunday. Because I, I told, I've been trying. Yeah, man. I said my parents are going to be there. My mom and my stepdad. And, uh, yeah, man. It's going to be fun. That's cool. Are you you gonna be at Temple? I assume. And, yeah, obviously yeah. they can, they pay me. Yeah, yeah. So, I know, I know. But I, I, got, well, I, didn't know, I didn't know if you had something planned because like, you you reacted to that. No, way. well, no, we get on. Uh, no, I think that's awesome though. Yeah, man, dude, I've been trying for a while. Like, hey, come to this church, you know. From so, yeah. off the you know I'm, I'm gonna be at Temple too. I know you will be. I'm sorry. You, I guess where all f- one, one, two, three, four, five, six of us are gonna be tomorrow. tomorrow. Sure will. Can we say it together? One, two, three. Revive, revive conference. Oh, we were gonna do conference. Revive conference. Let's one, just say revive. It sounds. Bro, cooler. you know something? One, I'm two, having three. Hey, we're saying revive on three. That's where we're gonna be tomorrow at the same time, All same right. place. Joe, you gotta say it too because you're All gonna right, be there let's too. Go. One, one, two, two three. Revive, revive conference. Uh, oh we said God. we're not saying uh, conference. First of all, can we agree? Oh what gosh. are you doing? <laughs> He said revive. You were completely late. off key. You you added the I'm zero. I'm never on key. You said one, two, three. I'm never. I have not one time in my life. Listen here. Anybody came up to me and said, hey, dude, you were on key. Not one time. Hey, let's talk about name brand the whole time instead of. Uh, dude, I'm topic, having a. I I'm really having study up on this epiphany, topic. man. I, I did, s- but it's. S- so, Brian. This is good. Epiphany. So, <laughs> so Brian Fischel's Brooklyn Pizzeria, best pizza in Goldsboro. Brian. Dude, that place is great. Is it good? Yes. Brian, Jared, I've never been. I want to go now that you're mentioning hey, it. How much we, longer do we have? Like 15 seconds. When, oh, my God. When we come back in, We're gonna I'm going to start it or start it by saying one, two, three. Corey, say one, two, three, revive conference, then open it up. Blackjack. I'm going to say it Blackjack. at the same time. We're going to try and say it at the same time. He's out. Right. You do it. This is not this is not gonna work. I like it though. Good morning, Black Jack. <laughs> Corey here with the Beyond Limits Morning Crew, having a wonderful time oh. talking about name brand versus generic. Currently sixty four degrees outside. I just walked out the door. Sun is popping through them clouds. Nice High of wow. eighty degrees expected yes. today. We are knocking on Shorts and door. Flip-flops. I'm telling you. We're having too much flip-flops. fun. Is there such a thing? <laughs> There is no such thing. I don't think there so is. So me and Corey just um, participated in our first yes. ever, this first ever, first annual, first ever food inaugural contest. <laughs> it was the inaugural <laughs> inaugural donut eating donut contest. Eating Listen, contest. guys, these two, these three, j- new guy Josh participated in this. Uh, he's back. Oh my new goodness. guy Josh is back from his year long sickness. Um, I don't even know About what it was, but, he was gone. but I'm gonna tell you, these three guys <laughs> just participated in a face shoveling donut contest. Oh, it was great too. To see how fast they could shovel a donut, Krispy Kreme donut. Yes. It's just one donut. Just one donut. Now, I had one before that, but <laughs> it is had, what it is. We had to warm up. We had to warm up. Listen, man, we're talking 100 there are only 190 calories. Thank you. In a Krispy Kreme donut. Okay, you Thank cannot you. preface 190 calories with the word only. Dude, you get There's these nothing, like quote unquote healthy 100 calorie packs. I mean, that is dude, not a lot. It's, it's like not even 200 calorie Watching packs. Watching you justify that, you go, I don't know if you, you can't see hey, it, but listen. you go to a blank space and like you look yeah. through me when you say it because you know it's, you know it's wrong. It's, no, no, no. See, now I have to take Jared's side on this. My man. I said Come earlier, on. 190 calories for a donut is not terrible for any right. kind of simple that's right. sugary right. nonsense. For a donut, yes. yes that's, for, right. it's, uh, that's not bad. Can we agree that 109 calories for a snack? 190. 90 calories yes. for a snack, a single snack, one serving, is excessive. Uh, no, I don't think so. <clears throat> what is the average person should take in, what, 2,000 calories a day? That's right. That's, yeah. that's based so off we, the, Hey, we still have 1,600 calories. Well, not me. I had two donuts. Or... Or 800 more donuts. Man, it today. was awesome, man. That was so cool. I'm, man, I have, I'm, ha- I'm having an epiphany. I feel like we should have a... Why you got to use the We big should words? start having a tour, man. Beyond oh, Lim- no. We should entitle it Beyond Limits Eats. No. And then we should just... <laughs> no. whatever, I don't agree wh- with this. I'm, I'm telling you, this. whatever whatever town we're going to, like somebody shouted out Brooklyn Pizzeria in Goldsboro, Beyond yeah. Limits Eats Goldsboro. 
And oh, we go to all the ooh, best spots. Yes. I'm telling you, man. Hey. It's good stuff. Look, I'm that just, does sound look good, for those of you who aren't on the live Help stream, you can't see the horror Joe, in Paul's face right now. I don't yeah. agree with it, but it did sound good Sounds when you good. said it that way. Joe smiling. Joe, Joe Money Jones. Sounds he, like Donner's Drivers and Dives. Dude, over there. I'm yeah. telling you. <laughs> beyond limit spin on it, though. We're yeah, going places. I'm ready for it. Let's hey, go. Guess what tonight is? What's tonight? I, I got to throw it out there. Go ahead. Okay. Oh, I know where you're Come going on. with this. 630 tonight yes. in Greenville, North Carolina. The Some. Revive Conference starts. Don't and miss it. Don't. If you are saying, I didn't get my tickets, you can buy tickets at the door. Cash, check, card, whichever way. I owe you. I, I, and that's a thing. So <laughs> <laughs> if you show up and you're like, man, I'd love to go, but I've got like 19 kids or five or four kids, and I, I just can't afford $15 a ticket. Come up and say, man, mm-hmm. I, 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 they, I'd love for them to be a participate in this. Right. I'd love for them to be able to go. And they're they're still going to get in. Yeah. Nobody is going to get turned away for lack of payment on this thing. I love um, that. I love now that. Now, we, we got to pay for the bands and stuff, so we do encourage you to pay. We but, encourage the yeah, pay. But. but if you show up and you're like, uh, I, I can't, then guess what? You're going to get to hear the gospel just the same mm-hmm. because um, God, is, God is good That's all right. the time. That's so right. 6.30 tonight, the doors open. The bands are here tonight. Uh, be there. Woo. B Square, more Get information excited. on that. Um, guys, but coming up right now, keep fighting the good fight with good fight unspoken. Yep. Good job. Hey, some of my kids were cracking up over here. Uh, bad Jared. Bad Jared. Me and Corey, see, we started this we started this morning at odds on mm-hmm. cheese. We ended up like BFFs with donuts. Donuts brought us together. Donuts brought us together. Y'all gonna eat another donut? Yeah, man. No, Jer- Josh, you go ahead. Eat no, I cannot eat another donut. Or Josh I can't eat another donut. Look, if, you, if you're watching donut, the live donut, stream, donut. Feel free, bro. You, you can tell I've had a few I'm donuts in my lifetime. And I'm trying to, I'm trying to um, get away from the donuts and get back into yeah. a more healthy lifestyle. So there's a. You're tr- say that again. Which part? What you? I'm trying to. So I'm trying to get back into a more healthy. Lifestyle. You're trying to get into a more healthy lifestyle. Yes, so trying to. Trying. You to. just shoveled two donuts into your mouth within Dude, a minute. I'm going to Great Wolf Lodge Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Paul, I'm not going to be eating healthy Monday, Tuesday. No. So why would I say? Well, I'm going to eat healthy on Friday, but I'm not going to eat healthy on Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Well, Wednesday. you know what? So, I'm going to have Thanksgiving meal, so I guess I'm going to eat bad all year long because Thanksgiving is going to ruin. Now, now we're talking. <laughs> Paul, Paul's about, saying this. Paul's going to be talking. eating Zaxby's sometime in, over this week. Probably. Is but that, that's a main course meal. No. That is a main course meal. <laughs> and there's a good chance hey, I'm going to eat a McDonald's food, too. Like food. the grilled chicken. And I might even eat a fast chicken food. nugget. But the thing is, that's a main course meal. Hey, can you do no, a store brand frozen chicken nuggets? Madeline will not even touch it. I yes, don't. I, do, I don't. I, I don't eat chicken nuggets from the store. Madeline will not I even. Can. touch I don't even I think do I did that when I was little. I think what I went for when I was when I was younger was just like frozen pizzas and frozen chicken wings every now and then. And that that concept kind of irks. What about me. the toasty? What about the um, ch- the pizza? Bites? Yeah, the the to- pizza, pizza rolls. No, pizza rolls. Yeah, yeah man, those are, yeah. Good. those are good. I haven't had any in a while, but those yeah. are good. Those are those very are good, good, man. man. Hot Pockets, bro. I'm not a Hot Pockets guy. I used to. I mean, I'm I wasn't like a, a fan, Jim but Jim Gaffigan has a hilarious Hot Pocket skit. You know Jim Gaffigan? Uh, hot Pockets. Mm-hmm. But yeah, dude, those were the things, man. Hot, hot Pockets. pockets. Are you it's still so eating funny. that same donut no, from earlier? It's another one. He got another one. Oh. Look at his shirt. I know. Look at his shirt. Liberty Flames, flaming out. No, I'm talking about all the I know, sugar, on, sugar his on his shirt. Flaming out. Look at all that, all that glaze on his shirt. Don't make no mm. sense. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mm. Gosh, man. <laughs> Lord, <laughs> Jesus. So, generic name brand. What do you, what what can you do name brand or generic? What do you have to do name brand? So like, corn. So my wife. Corn. Likes corn. okay, canned corn. Yeah, canned okay, corn. Okay. So my wife likes green giant and the and the um, green beans. Either one, food line. But Walmart, she doesn't like. So I think it even even from generic to generic. Oh you Lord! Find your own way there. Like um, 
we had Kroger when I was growing up, and my mom. Does Kroger still exist? Yeah, just not here. Um, <laughs> my mom would not eat any other yogurt other than Kroger yogurt. It was Kroger the yogurt. best. It was good. Man, I'm trying to think what else I have as name brand. What you? What else do you have that is, that is or that is not? That name is. Brand? That is. Man, there's a lot of things I can't do off brand. I'm just telling you. What name brand clothes? I can do off brand clothes. I can I can go I can roll into Target or something and, and pick up some clothes off yeah. brand. Yeah. Heck I could yeah. probably pick up a shirt from Walmart and not think twice about it. Yeah. Yeah. I've done I I jacked it. But if I'm buying a suit, I, I gotta I got I gotta get name yeah. brand suit because they just fit yeah. well. You mean not name brand suit. No, I have to get name brand. Have to get name generic, brand. generic. I can't do a generic suit. But not. It doesn't have to be like the five thousand dollars. But what's a generic sh- suit? You go like if you go to Walmart, they have suits. You, yeah, they got suits. Or or you know not just Walmart and not whatever knocking it. But I I just I like if like you know the the preachers from the nineteen eighties and nineties. The 90s, preachers. They they used my to, dad the preacher. They used to wear the suits that were like super baggy. You know, yeah. I, I, I just I don't like the super baggy suits. It looks like um, Wallace them. Phillips. So what's up, man? Hey, we have a new video coming for you soon. It was recorded yesterday, and you already did it, right? That announcement video you yes. added to it. Yeah, yeah. You, I could new show footage. It to you you want to see it? Are you serious? Like up there? I could throw it up. There. I could throw it on their screen. Hey, good morning, Kim. I agree. Mayo has to be name brand. Are you serious? I could do Dukes, Warcraft. And somebody will record Madison tonight. You want to see it? Yes, man, do that. Wallace Phillips, before we go live on the air, if you're watching, let me know. We're going to throw this up, the announcement video, so you can see it. The uh, the amended it's one, true. the added one. So my wife says that off-brand. Are we ready? Off-brand. Sorry, I'm no, <laughs> trying to engage our... Yes. We're about to show the audience. Okay. Sh- yeah. No, no, I didn't. I, was, I wasn't saying. He says it, and he says it's name brand all, all right, day, by the way. But yeah, stand by for the video. All right, so these are the videos that we film here um, for the church, for for Carpenter's Shop. Yep, yep. Carpenter's Carpenter Shop International in Ahoski, North Carolina. Yeah, so we uh, Corey does some videos, so we film them. Believe it or not, Beyond Limits films a lot of stuff that we don't yes. put up here. We do a lot of filming. Um, I'm just saying yes right now. Yeah, it's really yeah, it good. It is true. It is true. It is true. So this is just really, really quick. Does your church do announcements? Um, if so, hey, there's a good chance that we could help you out yes, with that. Yes, we so could. Looks like. Good morning, Carpenter Shop Church family. We just want to let you know that the Missions Cafe opens every Sunday morning at 9 a.m. Please come by and enjoy some fresh homemade treats, coffee, and you can also pick up these cool t-shirts for only $10. That's right. When we visit to our cafe, we'll help you build relationships in here and offers hope out there. And if you can't make it by before service at 9 a.m., please remember that we also have it open after service as well every Sunday. Hope to see you guys today. And don't forget, Wednesday nights are so important to you. You always need that midweek pick-me-up. These are great to get plugged into small groups. We offer Celebrate Recovery, Divorce Care, Adult Bible Study, On the Gifts of the Spirit, and Youth Group Ministry for all ages. Absolutely. Face the middle of your week by connecting with others. Small groups start at 7 p.m. and end at 8 p.m. Only one hour out of the middle of your week, but the benefits are eternal. Start in a small group at CSIC this week. Pastor Wallace is also in his series, Revelation 7 Churches. Don't miss this weekly message that speaks to the heart as Pastor presents applications about how Jesus addressed the churches in the book of Revelation. You'll be inspired, you'll be challenged, and you'll clearly understand the message that Jesus had for the church then and the message that he has for the church now. Don't miss Revelation 7 Churches. CSIC also offers a unique class, which is called the Gals Class, meeting every Sunday morning for girls grades 7 through 12. Each week, Pastor Cassandra meets in room 208 to discuss topics unique to teen girls. This is an awesome time to connect, and don't forget to invite your friends every Sunday at 9 a.m. in room 208. Also, ladies, we have a Bible study just for us. It's hosted by Julie Rasko on Thursdays, and we're going to be studying the Sheila Walsh book in the middle of the mess. This group meets Thursdays each week for fellowship at 6.30, and study begins at 7 p.m. Join Julie this Thursday and connect with other Carpenter Shop International Church women. Hey, ladies. 
Love and Actions Outreach Ministries is holding a women's conference entitled Women Who Pray, Persevere, and Pursue, Friday, April 5th, and Saturday, April 6th. It's hosted by Sylvia Walton and Dr. Lakeisha Walker. This event is open to all ladies. Tickets are just $30. Please stop by the Welcome Center for further information. CSIC leaders and volunteers are invited to join the North Carolina Assemblies of God Churches for a one-day training event entitled Church Ministries Initiative, which will consist of several breakout sessions. This event will be held March 23rd from 8.30 a.m. to 3 p.m. And lunch is free for all CSIC volunteers. See Pastor Wallace or Joy for more details. Our worship team family is expanding and we're looking for musicians and technical volunteers. If you play keyboard, guitar, drums, or bass, please see Worship Pastor Josh Phillips. In addition, if you have any interest in production or cameras, please let us know. The technical team is an effective part of ministry at CSIC. And also, we can't forget... Tithes and offering time. Absolutely. Please don't forget the importance of giving as that we now go into our tithes and offerings. See Pastor Josh Phillips. Yeah, if you play keyboard, guitar, drums, or bass, please... That was good. That was good. Oh, yes. That was good, man. That was yes. good. That was good. Woo! Come on, Corey. Come on, somebody. Come on, Corey. Come so on, You're hey. telling me I am. that Beyond Limits can film church commercials. That's pretty cool. Yeah, man. He does a great job. That is so cool. And the fact that we Paul just showed it to everybody. Everybody saw yeah. that yeah, Paul on the live stream. Now, cool. the reason we don't do it is because I do the our era commercials live. Yes, yes, you do. Sir. It's very yeah. cool. So Beyond very Limits cool. is actually He's doing getting a lot of likes stuff. right now. Yeah. Except they're live. That's right. You're right. Oh. My man. Yeah. yeah. Maybe I should start our, our uh, announcements on Sunday with, hey, this is Paul from Beyond Limits. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be fun. You should. <laughs> hey, this is Paul from Beyond Limits Temple. All the older people would be like, oh, well, this is Beyond Limits, and how do you go beyond them? <laughs> You're not they're, supposed but to go limits. beyond yeah. Yeah. You're the limits. You're We're not supposed to go beyond them. <laughs> Dude, I'm, I'm, I'm serious. Oh. I'm serious <laughs> about this Beyond Limits Eats. Wait. I'm trying Jones. to get... Where's Johnny Jones man, at? Get I'm Johnny trying Jones to, I'm the trying to get healthy. I'm trying to... So, I'm, so starting, you use that as your cheat day. Starting next Thursday. Next Thursday. I'm I'm back on the healthy train. And I've got That's to drop good. about 50 pounds. So, 50. Five, zero. Five, zero. And I have a whole, a whole team and a whole family to help hold me accountable. So, that's what I'm doing. So this, and I re-engage my hashtag Rise and Grind group that yeah, I love so much. Um, so, yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Back on the healthy train. Back. One week from yesterday, Back I'm there. The and I would start, train. you know, prior to that. But we're going to Great Wolf Lodge. We're doing the show on Monday. And then um, we're heading to Great Wolf Lodge for a couple of days. Man, excited about that. I'm pumped. Have I'm you ever seen um, green screen work? Yes. We, we recorded in green screen yesterday for the intro that's going to be played tonight at the conference. Yeah. And it was, it's... Awesomeness? It's fun. We recorded it all. I did a green screen at our church one time. I <clears> called <throat> Adam because um, I filmed, filmed, I did a, com like a, this was, man, this is, Five years ago, six yeah. years ago, um, we did a, a commercial because we were having a big, not a commercial, but an announcement thing. We did it for two or three weeks, but it's just yeah. way too much work for yeah. to keep doing. But Adam Carnes brought over a his green screen stuff from Unity at the time. Yeah. And we fixed it in what is my Sunday school class, and we filmed it there, and then we we turned the background into something different. It was cool. Money. A news desk. We turned it into a news desk. Bro, you have you've got sugar. Let me tell you something about this sugar. I ain't got no sugar nowhere. Are you crashing? Are you sugar crashing yet? Nah, man. I'm, hopping on, that bike. I'm hopping on that bike as soon as I check 41. I'm just I'm pedaling so-and-so. <laughs> you're going to get it. I'm gonna so get you're going to be on the bike all day today? I'm going to try to be. Yeah. I got I got a couple things I got to do. I'm not going to like administrative-wise, but for the, I like to say 80% of my shift I'm going to try to make. So how, uh, 
How far will you will you ride on the bike today? Man, so me and Stevenson you yesterday. Like a pedometer? No, no, I wish I did. But I bet that would do it. It probably would. I, I, need, it would. I, I don't know why do I did not do that. Yeah, yeah do I'll do that today. today. I, I, I plan on at least matching what I did yesterday on the bike. But me and Stevenson, we rode a good place. I think you'll be surprised. Yeah, like, you cover you a might, great deal, man. You might think in your mind, maybe we ran 10 miles. I bet y'all ride way more. We do, that. man. We do. We um, I'm telling you, good stuff. What's your bike route then? I mean, like, what do you We do? just go wherever, but we stay, like, in the downtown area, the Greenway. And, um, man, it was so cool, man. I, I wish I can say it because I'm not giving, giving away personal details. But um, we found we were on the Greenway yesterday. We found a, a missing juvenile who ran away from school on the, on the Greenway. We sat there, and the daggone email came out. And I, I passed a kid. He was sitting there, had this kick. He was just sticking his stops like, well, it's like 115. The kid's young. World. And I remember I was like, I just heard on the radio a kid ran away from saying, <laughs> I was like, what? Hey, man, what's your name? Oh, come on with me. <laughs> How old was he? 12. No way, dude. Where did he awesome. run away from? Sadie Salter. The school. Mm -hmm. And y'all found him. Mm -hmm. How have we not talked about that? I know, I that's know. awesome. I man. tried, I was there, but yeah, I did. With, I sat Corey. there. I had to sit there and talk to him. I was like, you know, he, I was like, why are you running away? He like, I don't want to go to school. So and so makes me mad. I was like, I go to school. <laughs> I was like, it's just got to happen. I was like, explain to them why. And, you know, I don't know if it did any good. But, I mean, yeah, we did that. God. And we did a couple other. What did we all? Yeah, we just rode. Man, it was so. God is so good, man. I'm Dude, sitting there, ride, I'm sitting there riding around. I'm thinking, man, I get to ride around in this beautiful weather. And at least, <laughs> at least try to make a. St. Patrick Day. You guys have a happy name branded, branded St. Patrick's, Patrick's Day. Day. Got to run. Yeah, we need to run. Later, Scott Stanton. Thanks for watching, brother. I like calling him Scott Bacon better. He likes to call me Salmon Cakes. Yeah, because of your pants. Yes. Because uh, they're hot pink. Why don't we call they're him? They're not hot. They're <laughs> salmon colored. There's a difference. Joel, I just pitched that to your dad, man. What? He's like, <laughs> what, you ever put some Beyond someone... Limit Seats? Yes. I, said, I told him. Are I those said, running shorts? Look, dude. Know. Yes. Listen, I said, I said, uh, I texted him. I said, I said, I, dude, you know when you pitch your dad something, man, he's either gonna like it, he's either gonna be excited about it, or he's gonna be like, mm, I, no, I don't like that, you know. So he, but I sit there, I was just like, new series, Beyond Limits eats, go around and eat at all the popular local restaurants in Boca Pit and Craven County, and he was like, he's like, that's a great idea, let's talk about it, you know. So, but I could just hear him, I could hear him say it on, on, like, I put his voice with that text. That's a great idea. Let's talk about that. Let's talk about it. You know what I'm saying? Joe, would you be willing to go around to Pitt County, Craven County, and yeah. Beaufort County? Eat where? So where is your favorite spot to eat at in Beaufort County? The freshest steam buns. <laughs> <laughs> Bill's Hot Dogs, Bill's man. Hot yes, we got to go do the I like, um, what is that? Jack's. Uh, Backwater Jack's? Backwater Jack's. Yes. Like Backwater Scott Jack's. Johnson. Where's that at? It's on, water water front, right? it's on the waterfront, right? It's never on the water. It's not on the water? Okay, I've never it is been. It's on the water. I've never. It's but it's water, off the water. water. Yeah, it's right. not on the water. Man, that's what, maybe, water. I don't know. It's near Washington. Yeah. yeah, right across the street. We really, I really want to go to that. I've heard nothing but good oh, things. Oh, it's fantastic. I've heard, I've heard the killing it. Me and Elizabeth went on a date night one time, and it was awesome. It's my foot. That's my foot. You guys are playing footsies. Come on, footsies. Footsies. Hey, we are talking You get one name brand versus generic. So can you do name brand? Do you have to do name brand on everything? Or are there certain things you can go generic on? Corey here says he can do generic cheese. And I'm like, no. But, um, and then he says he uses cha-ching toilet paper. That's right. Generic toilet paper. He used to, I'm, I'm telling you. God almighty. I dude, can't do that either. The, people in a day used leaves, bro. Like, you can use toilet paper. Dude. Well, I don't even dude. use. I can't do off-brand toilet paper. I can't do off-brand cheese. I want you to um, search your heart, Jared. I have sir. Hey, off-brand macaroni and cheese can't do it. Yeah, I can't do that either. No. It's got to be craft. Yeah, craft. Scott Johnson, enjoy that foot patrol. I will see you very soon. Yeah. And I'll be wearing a bike helmet and shorts. We wear to it. short shorts. They're not that short. Who's that? Jeremy. Jeremy. Bro, Jeremy what Smith. is going on? Who's the brought with you? What's up? Hello. Do you guys want a donut? Uh, you I do not. Do you want one? You can definitely help yourself. Please Three take one. Left. You can have them. You can have what, them. What, is this is this two? Hey, what? Oh, I got that. Sorry. Right. Forty. 
Twenty. Half of what you said. Hey, Brandon said if y'all want to give a teaser for Monday, uh, the devotion is going to be uh, a new take on the parable of the hidden treasure. So we're talking parables. Okay. Hidden treasure. Just new take on it if you want to throw a teaser out there. You want to do that in the third segment? That's fine. Okay. Five, four, three. I'm just now coming out of a sugar coma. Yes. Because <laughs> I tried to I tried to inhale a donut faster than Corey. So Corey got it in like <laughs> seven point three and it took me seven point four. So I don't know if we had a timer. It felt fast. I, mean, I timed I it in know. my head. I'll tell you this, I didn't do it as fast as I thought I was gonna do it. Yeah, yeah. But Josh, new guy Josh, man, I got to tell you, and I'm not trying to, dude, you know, the gig you too I'm much, in, but dude. I'm in. I know where you're going here. He, he was doing it in pieces, wasn't he? Yeah. yeah, yeah I'm nah, disappointed in just got to put, that, put it all in there, bro. Just get it. God and just because you, here's the warmth of the donut is going to make it mm-hmm. just kind of melt, mm-hmm. and you're just going to mm-hmm. be able to just, oh, you hardly good. have to do any work. Oh, I'm telling good. you. There are people right now lining up at the Krispy Kreme drive through Yes, bro. About to collect. Yes. Like. I need to go talk yes. to Krispy Kreme and see one hundred. I need to go. I need to go hook them up with a show sponsor. I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you, we just we just put on a show for them. So I'm gonna encourage y'all to go for a run today. That's I'm gonna get I'm on gonna the bike. bike. I can one hundred percent guarantee you that. Hey, you and I need happen. to get on it, brother. That 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 flying pirate's coming off April thirteenth, right? Y'all yeah. better hurry. Yeah, we gotta yeah. hurry up. We Come on, some, we got some catching up. Come on, up to fellas. Do. But yeah, I'm telling you, we're having a wonderful time in here, eating donuts, talking about name brand versus generic. Yeah. Well. I mean, I don't know if we're ever going to reach a, a clear-cut decision on that. I, mean, I, I think we're getting close both? to, yeah, depending both. on what it is. So we've heard yeah. from like we've heard uh, from a lot of people. My wife said no generic kids shoes yeah. because they're cute, inexpensive, yeah. but they only last a couple of weeks. Yes, yeah, yeah. Um, that's true. We, we've heard definitely no to things like personal care items, so shampoo, conditioners, deodorant, yeah, that I, kind of stuff. Yeah, we've heard no to that. Um, sodas, no. No to sodas. No to sodas. No. Why no to sodas? No to though? cheese. Because it's the primary in. It's the primary substance. Not hey, listen. You it. said no to cheese, there, Jared. Baby. So well, I'm sorry, Paul. We're sitting here. You, I, you start answering, and then I'm like, hold on. Did he just he say what say I think cheese. he said? He's trying to throw it in there. <sighs> I'm telling you. Food line brand Colby Jack is where it's at, bro. You Dude, need to I'm get talking on the train. sliced cheese. It is sliced. Colby Jack, I get the sliced Colby Jack cheese, yeah. and it melts just fine. Yeah, it doesn't melt. Oh my god! Hey, that the the quote unquote robber. Yeah, ah, oh, the Chinese man <laughs> being heralded yes. as the world's kindest crook. That the one you're talking about? That's yep. exactly what I'm talking so, about. This is so cool. This gentleman uh, robbed a woman as she was at an ATM in Haiyuan, China. I just I, that's the only reason <laughs> I wanted you to do the <laughs> yeah. story so I could hear I you say that again. I don't even know if I'm pronouncing that it right. It sounds very accurate, and confidence. your face is full you of confidence. That's right. Haiyuan, China, last Goodness. month. Miss, yes. Thank you for that. She was suddenly accosted by a man <laughs> wielding a knife. She turned around, this guy's holding a knife at her yeah. back, and she's getting the money out. He says, "Give me your money." Yeah. He looks at it. It was two thousand five hundred yuan, which is. Three hundred and seventy-one dollars right, U.S. So, currency. So this man, yes, I did. This lady Robs with a knife. Three hundred thirty-seven dollars. Yes, that's what he takes from yep. her. Three hundred seventy-one dollars. Three seventy-one. Yes. Okay. Three hundred seventy-one, and uh, he, he's he's unhappy with this. He's like, this is not enough. You know. Yeah. Well, he says, let me see your account balance. She she hands him the receipt. He sees that her account balance is at zero, and he's just he <laughs> chuckles. He laughs. He's like, no, nah, take this money back. I don't need to be robbing yeah. you. So I mean, he had some moral about him. You know, but Somewhere. he was going to rob this You're woman. You're too broke to be robbed. Yes. You know, yeah. Yeah. but hey, listen, I don't know. Chinese Robin Hood. That's I'm sticking what you with call that. Them. I'm Robin sticking Hood. with that. <laughs> Better believe it. Yeah. Chinese Robin Hood. Yes. New guy Josh asked me that. How can he be a Chinese Robin Hood? Robin Hood robbed the rich to give to the poor. Yeah. So then I asked him, I said, well, would Robin Hood rob the poor? And then Josh was defeated immediately. He was defeated. And then Always. he ate defeated. four donuts in a row. I'm telling you. Come on, Josh. guys! We are having such a good time in here talking about Chinese Robin Hoods, eating Krispy Kreme donuts. But let's get back to the music with "Counting Every Blessing" by Rin Collective. Yeah. Ooh. All right, Nikki. I one hundred and thirty thousand percent agree. I cannot do un- name brand coffee. Cannot do is green un- name brand no. Oh, Green Mountain is not generic. Um, and absolutely no name brand, no off-brand um, Q-tips because they're terrible. They don't have any of the 
cotton at the end. So it's like you're cramming a stick in your ear. Dude, I... I man. Corey! What's up? <laughs> what? Corey! What? Tell me about them off-brand generic Q-tips. I can't do it, man. I think I've bought them before. Yeah, I've bought them before and threw them away. Well, you know, you're a little too hard to please. That's your problem. No. You need to work on your, you know, work on your, your what's the word? I'm, I can pronounce all these big words in the story. <laughs> Corey, I, I was like, think of the I word. was like, who's, who's, who's Tony? Work on your expectations. <laughs> Who said what? Tonight? Wait for all said. What's up? Hope the conference goes off awesome, Tony. And oh, I was yeah. like, wait, who's Tony? And he meant tonight. He just <laughs> Green Mountain. What is Green Mountain? Green Mountain so, coffee. Uh, it's like a yeah. K-cup coffee. Oh, generic yeah. coffee. I do buy that, believe it or not. Oh, good. Do I prefer? Really? Yes. Do I prefer to? No. Like, what's Dude. generic? What's what's generic coffee? It's the K-cups. Like, Food Line brand. Okay. Food yeah, Line brand. Can't do it. So, like... Yeah, I prefer not to. But let's be honest. I'm getting. I'm, I'm, You're right. You don't cram a Q-tip into your ear. You gently. I I'm in it for. It's gotten hot. What have y'all been talking? I got this fan. Yeah, thank yeah. You. It got hot in here real fast. No, he's had the fan the whole time. Has he? It's sugar. Yeah. That no. is your heart <laughs> telling you bad decisions were made this morning, man. <laughs> it's not the sugar. It, I I it, it, it is. No. <laughs> yes. Uh, what is her name? Um. Gabby. Hey, Gabby. Gabby. So. Come on, Gabby. We Come have, on. We have All got. Right. Yes. Go. Come on, Gabby. Hey, you're going to have to move this a little bit. Sorry. For, for Gabby, so she can get some pictures for the live stream of her talking. Look, oh, talking you want to. You wanna... Does it go down? Or if it's locked into place. Don't break it. She can. There. No, that's yeah. fine. I'll, I'll figure it out. This is Gabby. Everybody say, hi, Gabby. Hi, Gabby. <laughs> <laughs> Hope you find my buddy. Good morning, Amber. Get you up there where everybody can hear you, see you. We are going to, are, are you shy, Gabby? You're not shy, are you? She does not live up to her name. Gabby. She doesn't gab. <laughs> okay, so you're, the, everything's turned off. Nothing's yeah, live right now. Live, but you can at least look like you're talking into the mic. Yeah. So we can get some good pictures of you. Yes. Snap pictures. Um, what grade? What grade is? What, what grade, grade are you in? in? Second. You're second. in second grade? She's wow. not shy. Wow, really? A, a third, a third grader thinks there, I'm sure. nine. What? A third grader thinks you're nine? Are you kidding me right now? Oh, my word. Have you seen how tall she is? Man. You are, I thought you were 17. What's your favorite sub, what are you, what's your favorite subject? Um. Math and science. Math, Math and science. science. And That'll reading. get you places. And reading. And reading. I have a 4.0. 4.0? Wait, what grade are you in? Second. And you have a 4.0? Yeah. Good Lord. And I started, started at a 2.0. <laughs> but we couldn't find the 2.0, so I started out at 2.1. That was 2.0, and then I was 2.1. That is awesome. Man, everybody is saying hi, Gabby. Oh, they love them some Gabby, that's cool. yeah. That's a bunch see, of people. So if you wave that way, they get to see you. Can you wave to them and say, hey? <laughs> she says, hey. Um, so she, Gabby's got a 4.0. Guess who else in this room has a 4.0? Why are you looking at everybody but me? It ain't me, I promise. <laughs> I said, guess who else has a 4.0? She, she didn't even give me time. She went straight to Corey, Josh, Joel. Corey's pretty smart. Pretty smart. Or I'm not nine, no, man. Trust me. You are pretty smart. She's a 4.0 reading level. That's okay. We're talking 4.0. Uh, 4.0 reading level. That's Gabby. That, that's, that's more us. Yes. Yeah. Do you like to you you like to read like big books? Man. Yeah. I have a Captain Awesome book in a car. And a what? A Captain, Captain Awesome. A Captain Awesome in a new kid book, and it's really cool. And I'm on the very last chapter. Captain, what's Tell me about Captain Awesome. Hey, can you so, flip the live stream to pick up her mic? What you mean? Yes. Can they hear? Can y'all hear her? Can you guys hear Gabby? My live my live stream ain't uh, working right now. Is yours working? Yep. Yeah, we're on. Good. Yeah, we're good. All right. Yeah, we'll do that. Here, use this. Use this. Uh, they didn't say yes or no. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, she's oh, yeah, 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 good. There you Perfect. Go. <laughs> All right, so yeah, tell, I'm sorry. Tell me about um, Captain Awesome. And um, he has a sidekick. He, it, it's a pet hamster, and he, his name's Turbo. And then there's um, um, a bag. 
that's a dog. Uh huh. And it's not really a bad villain. They just like to pretend like it's like a comic chapter book. Yeah. But um, it, the dog, it got the frisbee from Captain Awesome and Not Your Cheese Man. Dude, this is my kind of book! Captain Awesome and Nacho Cheese Man? Wait, and, they're, and they're both, and their name is both, um, Captain Awesome's name is Eugene, and then Nacho Cheese Man's name is Charles. And, um, the hamster, it has a cape on, on, not on it, on it when it's in the hamster ball, and then, like there's this one picture where it's like it's flying into they're flying into outer space, and the ball it um it has flames from from a, a little hole and it like so they're shooting hole. out, and then there's this girl named Sally which is the new kid in their class and then no, this she's way more interesting this than girl <laughs> this girl um this girl um th she makes fun of Sally. <laughs> and Sally doesn't like it, and then Sally's cat, Mr. Whiskers. Mr. Whiskers. Um, yes. Mr. Whiskers. I don't like it as good as the nacho cheese. But. <laughs> <'Cause> <laughs> Tell them what the hamster's name is. And Turbo. 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 And he, and he runs around in his ball with his cape on. That's what I'm talking about. And, um, this is exciting. Captain Awesome. Sure, right. Captain no, Awesome, he, he wanted to keep... Um, Mr. Whiskers, and he named Mr. Whiskers as his um, second sidekick, and his, he named it Mr. Whiskers Funny Cat, and um, he was going to name and it was also called Orange Juice and Orange, and it was or it's orange and white. Guess what? They don't like the name Orange Juice. You know why? They don't like healthy things. <laughs> Continue. Sorry, they're going to get sidetracked. Orange juice is full of sugar. I thought Lori was on a diet. Dude, I stay on a diet. I'm on a diet. I still am on a diet. Yeah, Lori was on a diet. I thought 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 they don't call it a bike ride. They call it um. They call it something else. And <laughs> I can't remember what it, it is. It happens all the time to us. And um. I like that. Smack the middle school. Get discouraged. You just jerk along. They call it something and, else. Um, <laughs> She's being radio. And they, they, they um take off in it. And then they find Sally's bike, which is in the moving um, van, and they think Sally and her family are alien spies. No. And um, they I think that jump, about him. They they what jump into a pile of leaves. <laughs> Captain Awesome jumps into a pile of leaves, and then Nacho Cheese Man is like, "What's that?" And it was the moving van, and then they went to explore. I have a question. So didn't, at the beginning of the story, didn't you tell us that you weren't all the way done with the book yet? I'm not all the way done. That's page one. Right, right, right. <laughs> <laughs> She's about to get us all involved in a story and then not be able to tell us how it ends. Do you, do you we're, know we're how it ends? We're getting ready to go about the second uh, book after uh, this. Uh, um, there, there, and I do know some part of the last, I'm on chapter nine, which is the very last um, chapter, and there's a... There's a after, it gives you some of the fourth book, and, um... You've read three of these? We'll go out in the car and we'll get no, chicken read the rest of you. You've read one? But the fourth book is the one after this? Yeah. Okay. I'm sorry. I was behind. And, My bad. Um... Come on, Corey. <laughs> and, um, he, he said that Mr. Whiskers has to leave him, and, um... He it it um he gets he gets really sad and Nacho Cheese Man and him get really sad. It's your favorite. And Nacho Cheese Man. That's that's, that's it. Man. That's your synopsis. All right. Nacho Cheese Man. Great. Corey just bought the book on Amazon while you were talking about I, it. I would. I would. 
after that. Nacho Cheese Man, that is awesome. And you haven't even finished the book yet. You can come back and tell us how it ends. Great job, Gabby. Great come job. back and tell us how it ends. I'm serious. Yeah, we want to know how it ends. Is it, a, is it an yeah, AR book? Yes. yes. Is it, it is an AR book, so you get points for the for this. And I'm at 200 and something. 200 and, are you a part of the um, million... Is it the million millionaire where they get over a million pages read or words read? Good million Lord. words read. Sure yeah, Wintergreen does that. No, I'm I'm trying to get as much points as I can so I can get many tickets for the carnival at the end of the year. There you so go. So I can go on all these fun things. And do the cakewalk. There's no cakewalk. What? He can turn How do you have me? Hey, if there were, if, that, if, that, if he was gonna go to do a, a, a cake, well, all the cakes would probably be generic. No, yes. they would not be. They would all be name brand. That's the best type of exercise, though, a cakewalk. Yeah. Yes. Do, do, you can walk do, do, and get do, cake do, at the same do, time. Do, do. Yes. And, I love the cakewalk. And um, there's yeah. there's water slides. Like a what? Party. And there's a video game trailer. <laughs> and there's like you can well, get hot candy. Hot dogs and your parents can come. What's your favorite color? Uh, orange. Teal. Pink. Teal. Orange. Teal. I thought you said two. Teal. Orange. Teal and pink. Teal, orange. pink, coral. Orange. Coral. Coral is in the white family. Is light. it? Is it more? Light what color purple. is coral? Here is what I found. Nope. Not morgue. Not morgue. <laughs> not morgue. And, uh, <laughs> Oh well. Purple and light purple and light blue, yeah. which is not the same as turquoise. And um. Wrap it up, kid. <laughs> and light grayish, like that color. And orange. I seriously want you Speaking to come back and tell us the end. Syracuse like went down. So is Carolina and Duke tonight. Carolina and Duke. Part three. <laughs> and. Up in a different. Tennessee outcome. plays tonight. Really? You're a Carolina fan. Yeah, producer Joel's Carolina Tennessee fan. Tennessee plays tonight. Whew. Hey, remember plug um, Monday when we're on this? The, what is um, it? Plug? The parable. Oh, Lord. Another parable. <laughs> what parable? Uh, oh, what time is the conference? Hey, tonight? great job. 7 to 9. 7 to 9, Seven to nine tonight, yeah. yeah. Doors right. open 6.30. Whoa! How much time do we have? Perfect. Oh perfect. boy, hey, are we talking longer this time? No, no. Johnny doesn't like it when we okay, do that. Okay, good deal. <laughs> hey, he says hey. it sounds like a talk it show. It needs to be consistent. It needs to be. It needs to be consistent. Sounds like a talk right. show. Right. We don't want to rush into, no. the, into the transition. Hey, listen, we are all about excellence and fluidity. Excellence. Oh, Su uh, Suzanne Craig's right. so, just like our page. The pink one. So can we? No. Creatures landscaping. If you need landscaping done, yeah. now's the time Creatures landscaping gets it done. So I've been trying to talk them into going digital. Creatures instead landscaping. Instead of printing off, you know, 1,400 copies every time. It so keeps Paul from taking the whole table off. It's true. <laughs> it's true. So, but in all actuality, my printer was out of ink, so I was like, man, I better bring Paul an iPad. So I did. So that's my wife's iPad. Um, so, yeah. So, we're a parable. A new take on the on a on a on a parable. That's what's happening Monday. I'm excited about it. I'm excited about it. Switching mics now. Uh, yeah, no. Welcome back, guys. This is awesome. We just had a we just had a uh, visitor, Gabby. Yes. Uh, who is in second grade? Mm -hmm. Four point reading level. Explain to us an entire book about we nacho were, cheese. About a character nacho named cheese. Nacho Cheese, yeah. and it was really, it was fun. It was awesome. Uh, I, and might I say, you might. I, I could not have done a better job. It was really good. I agree. It was very good. I agree. And she hadn't even finished the book. I know. She still has more to read. I'm excited. I am a little disappointed though that this carnival she's trying to go to does not wall. have a cakewalk. Yeah, cake I'm wall. like, come on. Yeah, a generic cakewalk. Come on, Gavin. <laughs> hey, tonight. Yes, we're in East North Carolina, so we everybody are. already knows this. That Carolina is once again facing off against Duke. Is that oh, the Tennessee man. game? And huh? <laughs> no, no. Tennessee is not important to Eastern North Carolina people. Um, but I will say that that Carolina has to win tonight because the Duke fans have already hopped up and said, "Well, Zion's back," but you know, 
Uh, mm. What's the excuse if Carolina wins tonight for them? And I asked the SWAT team, uh, the chat group we have, yeah, and right. it's going to be, well, well, he's been gone for so long, he's got to get back into it. I, I saw him play last night against Syracuse. Dude's ready. He's at 100%, he, he just so there's no excuse tonight. Yeah, he he just a shot the whole game. Yes. Yeah. Oh, come on. Absolutely. Yeah. Joel, That's because they were all dunks, Joel. Yeah. It, 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 Joel, our producer, is also a Carolina fan, so we are psyched about that, the Revive Conference tonight. But either way. So – we 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 have a story. We told the story a couple of, uh, you know a couple of segments yep. ago, but it is so awesome. Yep. I just want to touch base on it again. Yep. This service dog for a lady who has um, really dramatic seizures. I mean, we're talking two, three hour seizures, and so she got a service dog, and this service dog not only helps her throughout her day to day life, like crossing the street and um, alerting people when she has seizures. But this dog, man, it has a extremely large vocabulary. Yeah. So she can say, for instance, go get the name brand cheese yeah. out of the refrigerator, and it can open the refrigerator door. The name brand cheese. <laughs> yeah, it took you a minute. <laughs> took you a minute. And then she'll say, um, I don't care what kind of cheese. He can open the door and get the cheese out. Or she can say, bring me whatever from the refrigerator. It can bring it to her. That's so when, cool. When she's out in public and she's buying things, yeah. yeah, this dog can pay for what she's buying. She gives it the card, it gets up, it does the tap to pay, and boom, yeah. on she goes. It is it's so awesome, man. That yeah. is cool. The fact that the dog can understand her that well and knows what she needs, can sense things, it's a blessing. And, and, I, and I love what she said about it. She said prior to... The dog. Yeah. I was invisible to people or I was always pitied upon. Right. But now with the dog, you know, I, I'm noticed and people take an interest in what I do. That's so good stuff. Awesome man. stuff. Yes, it so is. So Monday's normally our devotion day. Yes. Yeah. And we got we got a little heads up on what that is, right? Yeah. Uh, so we're in the middle of a series here on Beyond Limits. Every, um, every Monday is going to be <laughs> our devotion <laughs> did you hear that the, uh, yeah. i'm sorry sometimes i get too close to the mic and forget no, where i'm going is devotion <laughs> monday um and uh so it, it's a way for y'all to get your week started right and so we give a devotion and it's always going to be the second and third segment and we're in the middle of parables yes like so christ tells all these stories mm -hmm. Uh, in the Gospels, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. And um, they're awesome stories because they got these huge meetings mm -hmm. behind them. And we're in the middle of one that's going to come Monday, but it's a new take. Brandon Nicholson, our writer from Kenson Dental, uh, put a huge new spin on it, and it is really cool. Ooh, so you have got to tune that. in I on Monday. Wait. Mondays I can't are wait always for that. great. Listen, y'all, we love you. Yes, Thank you so do. much for tuning in online um, on the radio, 98.3 The Bridge. Coming up next, Kevin and Taylor. Boom. Yes, sir. Why you do that, man? Why'd you do that? Like you paused on purpose. Oh, that's a. He looked at Paul like. Cheese man, nacho cheese man, nacho cheese. Oh no, 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 no. Eighteen. Wow. Yeah, it says that we oh. have to say Kevin and Taylor every every day. We don't. Oh, you good. Every once in a while. Oh. Also. Awesome. I thought it was every day. Yeah. yeah. What so if we, we say Kevin and Stacy? Is that acceptable? <laughs> I don't know. I'm out. Kevin and you're out. So Jeremy. Oh, oh right. we'll be easy. Hey, guys. Hey, buddy. That's Sally. Sally. Sally Lloyd. Right. It is a lot of hot. That's the name, girl. So it's very um, warm in here. We were thinking. A new series, machine. Beyond Limits Eats. So yeah, we're going around right here. I'm cute, telling you, you think about person. it. Like, we go all around to Washington, New Bern, Greenville. We go to some of these other places, like out in Pitt County, uh, like in Aiden. 
just do like a quick little like video yes, session in there yes. and order like the, what the locals get. I'm telling you, man, that'd be cool. That'd be fun. We need a mobile radio yes, studio. How does that work? We do because I have to do a lot because I'm doing a lot of remote from um, at Unity. But it's record. Yeah, but there's a. It's not. Uh, it's live, but it's not live. Okay. These are the other characters. Yeah. We're going to say goodbye to the people. Oh, yeah. Hey. Hey. Yo! We love you. Guys, we love y'all. Thank you for tuning Bye-bye. in. We got a whole lot of good ideas Bye-bye. brewing. Can't wait to bring you the Monday Bye-bye. devotional. Want to thank Gabby for coming in come here on, and giving that Let's awesome go. story. Bye. We want her to come back and tell the rest of it when she finishes. <laughs> Finishing it right and now. don't forget, Revive Conference starting tonight. Yes. Running through tomorrow. Get your tickets. We'll see you there. Paul. Corey. Jared. Joel. Joel. Bye, Joel. Bye. <laughs> hey, peace, love, and grace. Yes. God bless you. Love God you. Bless you. Bye. Bye.